I know a lot of people who are in love with the show are people who love the Miami show band and love the music of the show band era. But I think anybody who loves music in general, because the stories about music and the music that's in the show is amazing. So if you're into music, if you're the kind of person that loves sitting in a pub, listening to music on a Saturday night, come to the theatre and listen to music instead, because it's ten times better. Um, well for me anyway, the first time it's the first time I've ever played somebody who is alive and like who I've met, which has been really challenging, but also really helpful because you can talk to them and ask them the questions you would normally just assume when you're reading a text. Um, so the challenge is that, but also it's brilliant, and it's amazing that we're bringing the, a true story to life as well. It's a lot more rewarding than just bringing a story involving the songs to life, I think, as well. Um, because of the scale of it, I mean, it's the biggest production I've ever been involved in, certainly. Um, the music's amazing, the set's unbelievable, the costumes are so many costumes and they're all brilliant. Every the production value of the show is huge. I want to be part of the song that got you. I suppose the fact that we're all playing live instruments on stage makes it different. Uh, obviously there's some recorded music as well for transitions, but we're all playing, uh, there's like six instruments on stage at any one time. There's a saxophone, there's bass guitars, acoustic guitars, electric guitars, drums, the whole shebang. So like I say, you know, it's like going to a gig as well as going to a piece of theatre, which is different from any other musical I've ever seen. But we'll be surprised by just how much joy is in the piece, that's really what it is. It's Obviously there's the side of the Miami show band that everybody knows about and made them sort of world famous for some of the wrong reasons, but the story focuses on the characters who were involved in that band and the personalities there and the real heart and joy that they loved doing what they did and like we're really loving showing people that as well. Uh, my name is Gary Crossan. Uh, we're coming to the Millennium Forum in Derry, where I'm from, uh, from the 22nd to the 24th of August, and I really, really hope I'll see you there.